A new wave of photonic processors is revolutionizing AI. These chips use light instead of electricity, enabling faster and more energy-efficient AI computations. Companies like Lightmatter are leading the charge, with breakthroughs in photonic tensor cores and optical neural networks. This could be the key to pushing AI beyond the limits of Moore's law. NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang says AI demand could actually grow during a recession. At GTC 2025, he argued that companies will double down on AI to stay competitive. With 87% of NVIDIA's revenue tied to AI and $60.9 billion in free cash flow, the company is well positioned to weather any economic storm. The IEA warns that global trade tensions could slow AI's momentum. Tariffs and supply chain issues may delay data center projects and strain power grids. In the US, data centers could drive nearly half of electricity demand growth by 2030, but 20% of projects are already at risk of delay. After a high-profile Mar-a-Lago dinner, the Trump administration backed off plans to restrict NVIDIA's H20 chip exports to China. The chip, crucial for AI inference, had been under scrutiny. NVIDIA reportedly promised new U.S. investments, swaying the decision. Critics warn this could give China a tech edge. Some Christian leaders are cautiously optimistic about AI. Tech platform Glue is working to guide faith communities in using AI for good. With former Intel CEO Pat Gelsinger now leading Glue's tech efforts, the goal is to shape AI in ways that align with Christian values. Some companies are banning AI tools like ChatGPT due to accuracy concerns, but employees are struggling to keep up without them. Experts warn against secretly using AI, urging workers to talk to managers instead. The debate highlights the growing tension between productivity and policy, 